Up next, how does a solar battery work? Hi, I'm Jonathan Green from Teho, the place where Australians save time and money as they make the switch to renewable energy. Check out our website for more information. Solar batteries are becoming more popular due to lowering prices plus state rebates and incentives which is then increasing accessibility. At Teho, we get asked every day on how does a solar battery work and if you should install one. This is everything you need to know about how a solar battery works. Without a solar battery, a solar system works by generating electricity from the sun. The electricity generated from the sun through the solar panels is direct current, or DC for short. This travels from the panels to an inverter which changes it to alternative current, or AC for short. AC is what we use in our homes. This electricity is used by our home first. Considering most homes don't use all their electricity during the day, the solar system will export any excess electricity to the grid and the electricity retailer will provide a credit for each kilowatt hour exported. When a solar battery system is combined, in most cases, the solar will provide the home with electricity and the excess that isn't used by the home will charge up the battery. Once the battery is fully charged, all excess electricity after the battery is charged will be sent into the grid. Once the home is using more electricity than what is being generated by the solar, which is usually at night, the solar battery will discharge the stored power into the home. What are the benefits of a solar battery? There are a few main benefits of a solar battery. Number one, autonomy. Installing a solar battery at your home will increase your home's autonomy. You'll be able to generate, store and consume all your own electricity making you much less reliant on the grid. Number two, saving money. Having a battery can save you money. While the returns on solar are much stronger, batteries are becoming much more lucrative with state rebates and increasing uptake. A solar battery will enable you to use your stored electricity when you need it. If you're on a time of use tariff, the peak charge is when a lot of homes use their electricity. This is commonly between 2 till 8 p.m. Monday to Friday. The cost of electricity during this peak period can be around 50 cents per kilowatt, depending on which state you're in. Having a solar battery to help reduce this peak charge can save a lot of money. Number three, blackout protection. Good solar batteries will come with blackout protection. This functionality will allow you to use stored battery power when the grid goes down. You'll be smiling with the lights on and cold milk in the fridge or your neighbours will be seen in the dark with the beginning of some new cultures. Oof. If only I had blackout protection. Blackout protection is also great for those who have certain appliances which need electricity, such as pumps on a toilet for a rural property. Number four, securing your energy future. A solar battery combined with a solar system will allow you to secure your home against the aggressive price increases of electricity from the grid. And number five, accessing virtual power plants. A virtual power plant or VPP is a network of decentralized generation and storage units which are solar and battery systems across the country connected in one big virtual battery. When the price of electricity on the wholesale market goes up, the batteries will discharge together and earn the virtual power plant operator revenue, which can be shared with the owner of the battery system. Each virtual power plant is different, but the concepts are very much the same. Having a battery combined with your solar system will allow you to take part in these new programs. Can I achieve a zero dollar energy bill with a solar battery? Yes, you can achieve a zero dollar energy bill with a solar battery and solar system. We all use electricity differently and it's good to know that achieving a zero dollar energy bill is possible for some and not for others. 
there are many factors that contribute to whether a zero dollar energy bill is achievable. While some can achieve a zero dollar energy bill with just solar, others might need a combination of solar and batteries. While achieving a zero dollar energy bill is great, not being able to achieve one should not deter you from installing solar or solar and a battery system. Each kilowatt of electricity you generate and consume yourself is a kilowatt hour you are not purchasing from the grid at high prices. If I have solar, can I add a battery? A few years ago, most solar batteries were DC coupled. This means they needed to directly connect to a compatible hybrid inverter, also known as a battery ready inverter. Each solar battery manufacturer was compatible with different inverters, making the whole process difficult. There's still lots of DC coupled batteries in today's market, but most recently the industry has changed and more commonly solar batteries are AC coupled. An AC coupled battery allows a connection of a solar battery to nearly any existing solar system. It works by connecting directly into the AC wires in your home and it requires no compatibility with an inverter. If I have three phase connection from the grid, can I get a solar battery? Australian homes are usually single phase power or three phase power. The difference is how much the home can draw from the grid. To check what you have, simply open up your meter box and see if you have one main switch or three main switches. When inquiring and researching solar batteries, it is important to know if your home is single or three phase. This may determine the battery you choose. Those with single phase connection won't be two phase when it comes to choosing a battery. Phase, see what I did there? While those with three phases will need to be more careful with their decision. Depending on the manufacturer, some may not have a three phase option. Should I get a solar battery? Deciding whether a solar battery is right for you is always a challenge. A few things to consider when thinking about installing a solar battery are 1. Do you use a lot of power at night? 2. Do you suffer from blackouts? Or the third one, do you want to increase your autonomy? That was everything you need to know on how does a solar battery work. If you're considering installing a solar battery at your home and you'd like to find out more information, give us a call on 1300 22 92 92 or check out our website for more information. I'm Jonathan Green from Tejo. Thanks for watching.